My name is Andries van der Ark. I'm an associate professor in methodology and statistics at the Tilburg School of Social and Behavioral Sciences. I am also the coordinator of the school's research master program. The research master in social and behavioral sciences is an interdisciplinary program for students who like to do academic research and are excellent. The program is offered by four research groups in the school, social psychology, sociology, organization studies, and methodology and statistics. The theme of the program is individual in social context. We study the behavior of individuals in different social contexts. As an example, let's take a look at the following situation. An important decision we have to make in our lives is whether or not we donate our organs after we die, for example, in an accident. As a researcher, we would like to know how do we make such decisions? What motives do we use for such a decision? Can we predict who will decide in favor and who will decide against uh, donating organs? And can governmental campaigns influence our decision? These questions can be approached from different angles. A social psychologist may focus on the influence from peers such as friends and family. A sociologist may focus on the influence of cultural groups we belong to, such as religious groups. And organizational scientists may focus on our reaction to governmental policies and organ donation. A methodologist may focus on the appropriate research design and statistical tools we need to answer the questions. By learning to approach different research problems from different perspectives, the research master program will make you become a researcher who can think out of the box. The program is characterized by a high level of student activity and interactivity and takes two years. Almost half the time you will be conducting research supervised by top researchers of our school. Rather than a student, you may feel one of the staff. The entire program is in English and the maximum number of students per year is 30. Note that only students who meet certain criteria are admitted. For more information, please check our website or the video on admission criteria. The picture shows students who graduate in 2014. As you can see, they are a rather small bunch. I will try to characterize them and you can see for yourself whether you would fit in. These students have met the admission criteria and they are willing to work hard. On the average, they will spend at least 45 to 50 hours per week on their studies. This may be considerably more than students are used to in their bachelor programs. They like doing academic research and they want to be really good at it. In order to do so, they are motivated to spend a considerable amount of time on learning research methods and statistics. Some of them actually really enjoy uh, research methods and statistics. They have different backgrounds, but they're open to learning new perspectives in the interdisciplinary program. They like the active personal approach. You know, in such a small group, students cannot hide in the anonymous crowd. They discuss their research, they collaborate, they ask if they don't understand, and they call their professors by their first name. And most important, they feel at home at the university. If this profile fits you too, then you may want to apply for the Research Master in Social and Behavioral Sciences. For more information, please check our website. If you do have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact us.